Hey guys, this is Scott Leroy, Scott Leroy Marketing, coming in for the weekly tip. And today's tip is on a Teams update that just recently came out, obviously this week. All right, and this is about how you can actually move contacts from your individual account over the team or vice versa. So that's one big update that happens. Now the contacts are gonna be separated where you're gonna have your individual contacts and the team contacts, all right? So before you can actually view them in one location, now it's gonna have two separate portals basically. So what you're first gonna to wanna to do is sign into command, obviously, and at the top right, you're gonna have your name up here. Now you can actually set this default to either be your personal account or your team account on here, depending on which one you're gonna be utilizing the most. So in this case, I have it set up as the personal account. So all I'd have to do to move contacts over is click on our contacts option on the left-hand side, All right, and then once we click on our contact section, it's gonna come up with our contacts. So here's my, my preset smart plan, that, or sorry, smart view that I set up. All right, so now what I'll need to do is click the checkbox on the left-hand side of the contact or contacts that we wanna update. Once we click on that, much like always, it's gonna have the bulk action option up here. But if you notice, there's a new item down here that'll say change account. When we click on change account, we can now actually specify who's gonna own this contact. So as you can see, heads up, changing account will take a couple of minutes. During that time, you will see the contact in the original account. So if I change this, I can move it over to the team account instead. All right, and once I change that, it'll automatically start to update. So then when I go over to the team section, it might take a little bit of time to pull up, but as you can see, it's automatically here. All right, so that's the easiest way to go through and update that. All right, and then as you can see on the team side, then you can actually assign this to anyone you'd like to. All right, and that'll help out for the Rainmaker side of everything. All right, but that's how easy it is to move everything over to the team's contact. Now, the reason I wanted to show that is because obviously everything is separated right now where you can access it under personal or under your team account. And if you're trying to set up an opportunity, if you're going to do the opportunity under the team, the contact needs to be added under the team, whether you're going to move it this way or whether you're just going directly under the team section and adding a contact on here like you normally would. I just want to point that out because that's one of the biggest questions we're getting right now. All right, but that's how simple it is to move your contacts from the individual account to the team's account right away. So there you go. So that is your KDB command tip for the day.